Freddies! Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. My name is Emma and I am so happy you clicked on my Soup of the Week video. I hope you like it. We'll give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't done so already. For tonight's soup, I am making Zupa Toscana. I started by putting my Ninja Foodi to sear saute and then I put in my 16 ounces of spicy Italian sausage and just browned that up. And because my sausage didn't let off a lot of grease or oil, I ended up just adding a tablespoon of olive oil because I'm going to be frying up my potatoes in with the sausage and I'm frying the potatoes up so they don't turn into mashed potato while they are cooking in my crock pot. Then once the sausage had browned up, I added in two teaspoons of garlic Gave that a stir, stir, stir. Then I added a half a cup of onion. Gave that a stir, stir, stir. Then I diced up one russet potato and added that in. Gave that a good old stir, stir, stir. And let that fry up for five minutes. I added two cups of chicken broth. And guess what? I gave that a stir, stir, stir. Then I popped the lid on and I switched my Ninja Foodi to slow cook. And we are going to cook this on high for four hours. But when it has been cooking for three hours, we're gonna add a cup of heavy whipping cream, a cup of chopped kale. Give that a stir, stir, stir. Lastly, I'm going to add two slices of this fully cooked thick cut bacon and I'm just going to cut it into little pieces with my kitchen scissors and I'm just going to do it right over the pot. Now everything's in, I'm just going to give it a final stir, 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 pop the lid on and cook it for the last hour. And the soup is done. Now I'm just gonna serve it up. Delicious, super simple, super fast, hearty, delicious. I had some of this sweet cornbread I needed to use up, so I just put it in the oven just to warm it up a little bit for outside. And here it is all served up. I add a little Parmesan, some cornbread, tomato, and bacon. Delicious! And that concludes this week's Soup of the Week video. I hope you liked it. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you Monday for my What's for Dinner video. Have a fabulous weekend. Bye. And our lunch for tomorrow. My husband rated this soup a 10, and I rate it a 9.5.